And we begin tonight with developing news on that fatal stabbing in Providence. It happened early this morning on Dorrance Street. The deceased, a 41-year-old city man. And now Providence police tell us another man is in custody. Officers say they found an incriminating piece of evidence on him. Again, this is the fifth capital city homicide of the year. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lance has been gathering details and she joins us now live in Providence with the very latest. Shante. Jerry, Memorial Day plans changed for a family of a 41-year-old Providence man after he lost his life earlier today in a brutal stabbing. A Memorial Day weekend in the capital city turns deadly early Saturday morning. This after a 41-year-old Providence man loses his life in a stabbing. Providence police say the stabbing happened just after 2.30 a.m. on a downtown sidewalk on Doran Street near Fulton. The victim, who had multiple stab wounds, was taken to Rhode Island Hospital where he was pronounced dead. Police releasing this mugshot of the suspect, 52-year-old Araya Brinkley, also of Providence. They say Brinkley left the scene on a bike and was captured a short time later near the intersection of Broad Street and Pine. Police revealing to Eyewitness News that Brinkley was carrying a bloody knife. Detectives say the relationship between the two men and motive are unclear. And police are not releasing that victim's name until his family has been properly notified. Reporting live in Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Shante Lands, Eyewitness News.